Hey everybody, welcome to the Tabletop Spotlight, the weekly show where we go over a bunch of new stuff you can pick up at your favorite local gaming store. I'm Adam from Bowls, and we're going to dive right into our games of the week. Join the Galactic Senate and search the furthest reaches of the galaxy in Federation. Federation's a new one from Eagle Griffin. It is designed for two to four players and it takes about 30 minutes. In this game, you'll place your ambassadors in the Senate and choose their specific roles. While you're managing the politics of the Senate, you're also going to be sending out spaceships to complete missions at the furthest reaches of the galaxy to score more points. The goal here is to increase your influence and forge alliances to become the most prestigious delegation to win. How will you choose to spend your social currency in Federation? It's time to get your alchemy on in Aurum. Orum is a competitive trick-taking game where you play as an alchemist. You've discovered the secret to transmute base metals into gold along with your fellow alchemists. Now you've got to try to figure out the best way to get the most points possible and transmute your way to victory. Unlike other trick-taking games though, Orum has a do not follow the suit method of play. So you'll want to try to deduce what your fellow alchemists are going to play, correctly bid how many tricks you think you can take. If you're a fan of games like Spades, check out Orum for a golden twist on that trick-taking genre. It's time to back to the Planet of Crave for a brand new set for Card Fight Vanguard. Dragon's Masquerade is the latest set for Card Fight Vanguard to come out. In this set, the featured nations are Dragon Empire, Dark States, Brant Gate, Keller Sanctuary, and Stoiche. There's also the featured nation of Lyrical Monasterio. If you pick up one of these booster boxes, they contain 16 packs with each pack having 7 cards. And it's got the same rarity odds you've got with all of the other Cardfight Vanguard packs. If you're a big fan of dragons in Cardfight Vanguard, this new set is perfect for you. So head to your favorite store to get some packs of Dragon's Masquerade. Hey, do you like your party games nice and loud? Well, check out Really Loud Librarians. Really Loud Librarians is a merciless word-shouting board game made from the same people that brought you Exploding Kittens. Now, this is a party game, so it is designed for two or more players. How it works is pretty simple. You're going to draw a card, which will give you a category, for example, things that are round. Then your team will shout words from the category that begin with the letter on the racetrack. You'll move along the racetrack for every time your team gets a word right. And you're going to be racing against your opponents to win. Now, this can get a little silly, and it is recommended 8 and up, but uh, if you're going to play this one, keep that in mind with uh, some of the word choices. You know what I'm saying? It might only take 20 minutes to play, but I think really loud librarians will keep you going until you lose your voice. It's time to gather your flock and get on the Great Western Trail, New Zealand edition. The vast and hobbit-filled faraway land of New Zealand awaits you. I'm just kidding about the hobbits. However, you are a run holder traveling with your flock of sheep at the beginning of the 20th century in Great Western Trail, New Zealand. You'll need to help your family farm prosper and adapt to the new challenges that emerge. Now this is a standalone game and is the epic conclusion to the Great Trilogy. So if you've already got the first two games, this is the perfect addition to your collection. This game does add some new things. There is a fourth new type of worker, the Sheep Shearer. It also introduces a second type of delivery for wool. There's various sets of bonus cards for each game. Advancing on the Pathfinder track will also unlock different bonuses. Also, keep in mind half of the neutral buildings will change mid-game. There's also a streamlined job market and upkeep when delivering your sheep. Designed for 1 in 4 players ages 12 and up, games can take a little long at up to 150 minutes. But if you're looking for a good time with a longer tail game for your next board game night, check out Great Western Trail, New Zealand. Well those were the games of the week. Big shout out to our friends over at Dragon's Lair Comics and Fantasy here in Austin, Texas. They are the ones that have hooked us up with everything you saw here today. Thanks so much to them. I'm Adam from Bulls and I'll see you next time on the Tabletop Spotlight.